Hi, my name is Adam Flynn with our IT marketing team. And in today's training video, we are going to cover how to create a hail quote from within our easy quote program. As you can see, we already have one line established for our MPCI quote, but we're going to add a hail quote to this. You can do so by either double clicking this line or selecting the edit button. You can see after I double click, we pull up our quote line attribute screen and we are currently still under the MPCI tab. Just to the right of that is our hail tab, which we click where we can begin to input our hail quote information. To begin, I'm going to select the policy form I want to quote. For today's demonstration, we'll just select basic. Then I'll move over to our endorsements, if any should be applicable. For this quote, I'll select wind. Then I'll bump back over and select my coverage per acre. Again, for demonstration purposes, we'll keep it simple and do $100. If you'd like to add a practice, you certainly can. For this demonstration, I'll leave that blank. Continuing to move down, you'll notice we have a coverage information box, which will actually pre-populate the information once we hit save, so we'll skip over that. Bump over to our cash flag. You can see it's currently defaulting to non-cash, but if we were to select the cash discount, we'll get a quick confirmation message just ensuring this is what we want to do. I'm going to select yes, and you can see that pre-populates that discount percentage for us. Continuing to move down, you can see we can edit our yield information if you wish. For today's demonstration, I'm going to leave this blank. Just to the right of that, we have our ability to edit our revenue information. Again, we do have some pre-populated information there, which I'll just leave, but you do have that ability to edit if you wish to do so. And then finally, you'll need to enter our location information in order to select save. I'll just go ahead and select the top township range and section. Once I have everything in I'd like to quote, simply hit save. And you'll notice from within the full farm view, our hail information generates along the right side of this line. You can see here we have our hail coverage, hail premium, what type of hail policy we've quoted, and the subsidy. In addition to that, under the totals column, you'll also notice we now break down the guarantee, the coverage, and the net premium for both the MPCI and the hail. And then finally, let's bump over to the scenario view. You can see we have just our, our MPCI policy and the hail policy quoted here. Now you have the ability to quote or to compare policies with hail on or off or different hail policies altogether. In this case, I'm going to actually remove the basic hail policy by selecting this red subtraction sign. You can see that policy is now removed. I'm going to select Save. And now we have the ability to compare two quotes, one with hail and one without. And that is how you create a basic hail quote from within our Easy Quote program. If you have any additional questions, please contact your local marketing rep or your underwriter. Thanks so much and have a great rest of the day.